police officers so often see America as at its worst. You know, that's an unfortunate part of the job. But I want you to know that in you, we often see America at its best. And even lesser known are the countless acts of kindness and support, helpfulness that your officers perform. Always spoke to the director of the anti-war answer coalition, Brian Becker. He says the U.S. citizens want Obama to make a stand against police brutality. The fact of the matter is there's an epidemic, a pandemic, really, of police violence in the United States. Almost a thousand have been killed by the police this year alone. Uh, and the police have a license to kill. They have a license to brutalize. They never go to jail. And so there's no accountability. And it keeps happening. So what we see today is President Obama appeasing the police chiefs, the real law enforcement, uh, all over the country. But the people in the country, the people in the United States who elected Obama, they don't want this. They want him to stand up to the police and to do something about this. Police brutality and police violence and mass incarceration, uh, that's routine and it's been going on not just for a few months, not for a few years. That's the, the history of the United States. Routinely, the police use their guns and billy clubs and gas against the, the people. Everybody in America actually